EU triggers rule of law procedure against Hungary. The legal tool, which has never been used before, could see Hungary stripped of its EU funding for breaching the bloc's democratic standards. Here's a summary of the article. The EU has officially launched its rule of law mechanism against the Hungarian government on Wednesday, after the EU Commission chief Ursula von der Leyen slammed corruption in the EU country earlier this month. The move could see funds for Hungarian Prime Minister Viktor Orban frozen over rule of law breaches. We identified issues that might be breaching the rule of law in Hungary and affect the EU budget, said a deputy head of the Brussels-based commission, Vera Jorova. The EU Commission has been at loggerheads with Hungary's Conservative Prime Minister Viktor Orban amid reports that Orban was attempting to put courts and media under government's control. In November, the EU's top court shot down the law which punished people who help asylum seekers, also known the Stop Soros law, a reference to the Hungarian-born Holocaust survivor and US-based billionaire George Soros. If the EU Commission secures enough support, Hungary could face major cuts in EU funding, although the procedure can take months before it's complete. Last summer, the EU suspended payments from its pandemic recovery funds to the tune of 7.2 billion euros to both Hungary and Poland over widely perceived democratic backsliding and corruption. This post received a score of 27,000, with an upvote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. As a Hungarian, good. About damn time. If it's anything like Bulgaria, it's the old FCKS still dreaming of times past that screw the young generation by electing morons like this who just suck EU money and FCK the country dry. So they will OFC blame the EU as being evil and punishing them for nothing. Bonus points if they say that Russia is great and would treat them better. I think that's the problem in almost every country around the globe. Obviously, they've been more successful in some places than others. Former bloc countries most of the time are screwed cuss. They still have those old government FCKS that held good positions during the Soviet era still keeping the leash on us. They miscalculated. Poland hates Russia more than it hates the EU. Poland has history with Russia and Germany. Poland historically has been fucked from both sides at the same time so they naturally hate these two counties meddling in Polish affairs. I'm under the impression. The relation between Poland and Germany has become much better since 1990. And I haven't encountered any prejudice from the Polish. I'm German. Pole here. Got nothing but love for all the Germans I've met in my life. Can't say the same about most Russians. I mean it's the responsible thing to do. Hungary is siphoning money from the EU and using it fund corruption, basically. About damn time. The EU Commission has been at loggerheads with Hungary's Conservative Prime Minister Viktor Orban amid claims of his government misusing EU money and breaking the bloc's laws. Many observers also believe Orban is attempting to put courts and media under government's control. Orban's Fidesz party has repeatedly targeted Soros in their campaigns and accused him of hiring media, mercenaries, to take down Orban's government. More recently, Orban broke with the EU by saying he would be glad to pay for Russian gas in rubles. It should be easier to break his political power at the EU level now. Both Jansar and Le Pen lost their elections and PIS in Poland seems just about done with their partnership with Fidesz due to their support of Putin. Greater than PIS in Poland seems just about done with their partnership with Fidesz due to their support of Putin they aren't. The problem they have is that ordinary Poles are vastly against Russia so openly supporting Orban right now would be a political suicide. They still continue anti-EU, West politics. Finally, even their companions from Poland are annoyed by the Hungarian politicians. Betraying Ukraine and siding with Russians must have burned all bridges with Poland. You can tell even Orb. And knows this, after the election, victory. He went to Italy instead of Poland to celebrate with his right-wing bros. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.